So another fun little crafty thing that you can do if you're gonna perform with your horse, like what I do, is I always wanna have treats on me when I'm performing, but it's really tricky when you have a beautiful costume, like where do you put your treats? Especially where do you put your treats that it's not very obvious. So in the past I've used fanny packs that I have sprayed in different colors and I've put treat pouches under my skirt like on the saddle and tried to find different ways to have my treats kind of discreetly but somewhere easy to find them. And then I um, just recently came up with this idea and it was so much easier. So I wanted to show you, um, this is my pirate corset and I'll show a picture of me wearing it in the video as well. But you'll see this is my treat pouch here and I all I've done is actually just sewn it onto my corset, just very loose stitching. Like I am not a professional sewer whatsoever. So I have, um, and I always keep my treats on my right side. So I put it right down where I would naturally be able to reach them. And I just wanted to show you real quick how to make something like this, because if you, you may not even be a horseback rider, but maybe you're a dog trainer and you want to perform with your dog and you need your treats or potentially, um, with a costume, you just need to be able to put your phone in something. Um, Hobby Lobby has these little canvas pouches. They're only a dollar ninety nine. Uh, they come in black and cream. So the downside is that they don't have any colors really. So I just use the black, and the because it's canvas, it's really easy to glue to. So if you buy some trim, you know this I got it was like a dollar twenty on sale for this whole thing. So you find some trim that's in the color that you want, and all I did was cut it the length that I want. Try to not get any frayed edges. And we're gonna glue it down, but you wanna start with no frayed edges. Just go right here. Okay, I'm just gonna glue it on. It's pretty simple. Then it sort of blends into your costume and nobody will really notice it. And these I found are pretty easy to get the treats out of because they're a little, um, they're wide enough for your hand. Some treat pouches, the, the, they're too open at the top and the treats will all fall out and others are too difficult to get into. And then you have problems with them flopping around when you're riding. So um, these I found, this I found worked quite well for what I was doing and um, able to perform with it. And you, there's so many different ways you could doll it up. Okay, so once you get that one there, um, I'm going to take this one. Oh, I did it opposite. I'm looking at it upside down. That's okay. It'll be a little different. Okay. All right. So I could even put it slightly under the trim so there's a little bit of an overlap. Be a little creative there. And this, this dries really, really fast, the canvas material, so we just wanna make sure you get it right on there. There. Okay, now the end is actually a looped cord. And um, when you're wearing it for training, you'll wanna cut it, of course. Okay, so I um, cut it. And then if I was riding, if I didn't have a corset or something, you can just, it's long enough to tie around your waist. Um, I sewed it on to the corset, right? Uh, you know, just nice and loose. Cause if you have a real steel bone corset, like I do, it's really like, you can't really get through it very easily. So you're just gonna do it on the soft parts, but just enough so it stays. And the rest of the cord, sometimes what I do is I have it tied around very loosely. So if it's too tight, it's hard to get in, but you could also just cut it off. I left it on because in case I need to put it on something else or use it at some other point. And also by loosely stitching it here, you could take it off and use it for something else because I might want a different color for this particular corset. But that's how you make it. Um, they probably have these pouches at other craft stores, but I found mine at Hobby Lobby and um, all my other accessories as well.